Is this the makeup section? It's what do we want to make up This new complexion product I just picked up. It's a drugstore complexion product. Yes. And it is a product that I've been hearing raves about. Okay. It's not a foundation. It's a serum. This, what I will be reviewing is the L'Oreal True Match Nude Hyaluronic Tinted Serum. So... This is makeup and skincare all together because ladies, it's springtime and we know warm weather, hot weather is right around the corner. And on those hot days when you don't want to wear like a full face of foundation and things like that, you just want a little color, a little life while also getting health benefits from the products you're using. I think this will be perfect. So I tried this product with no primer, no setting powders, and no setting spray. On my face right now, I did my normal skincare routine. I'll link it, my normal skincare routine in the cards or in the link below. So that was about like 30 minutes ago. So I did do my eyebrows. I did put some mascara on. That's it. So this is my my face like naturally. No product. So let me come a little closer. Got a um a burn mark right here from the curling iron. I was trying to like lay my wig down and um I like burnt myself. So this is perfect to see if um this will give me like coverage. I know it's not supposed to give like a full coverage. It's said on a website like a light to medium coverage and medium coverage is good for me. So um yeah, so let's get into it. So it comes in like a little dropper. And by the way, this is in the shade 810 deep okay now let's remember this is not a foundation this is a, a hyaluronic acid serum well one percent is one percent pure hyaluronic acid so just want to take this and put it on my cheeks see what it's looking like okay I'm gonna, I'm gonna put some right on here to on that little burn. Not too much. It's not irritating or not, but just a little bit. I wanna see the coverage. I'm gonna take my, I got a new foundation brush. Um, this is the Smashbox Camera Ready Blurring Foundation Brush. So I'm gonna use this. Very, very light. Feels like very light. Like really nothing is really on my face. I thought it feel. Okay. I want a little bit more. See if you can build it. It's blending so nice right into my skin. It's like, just like blending right into my skin so beautifully. Yeah, so. Okay. 
okay. I mean, you can still kind of see it. Like I said, it's not a foundation, but it's really giving me um, really beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, wow. It's giving my, my skin really a beautiful glow, a hydrating look. I really like this. Oh my God, I really like this. Okay, let's see how it pairs with the concealer. Oh, okay. uh, let's try the um, concealer. So, um, this is my first time, and by the way, this is my first time ever trying L'Oreal products. Um, okay, so I purchased this, I purchased this concealer, the Infallible Full Wear Concealer in the shade Honey 414. But when I tried this on the other day, this was super light. So I wind up going to um, my local Walgreens and picking up the shade 420 Cocoa. Like this shade was doable, but I like to, when I'm wearing a natural look, I like to go to a shade that's closer to my complexion. Um, so this shade that I'm using, it is the 420 Cocoa. Really good experience. Oh yeah, see you guys, this is more, this is more for me. Yeah, I can work with this color. And this, and this concealer is thick, honey. It ain't going nowhere. I love a concealer that's not going nowhere. <laughs> that's not like the coverage. So let me blend this out. Is amazing. I love it. That's so flawless. I love it. So, <laughs> so I added a little blush, or maybe a lot, but I think it's cute. <laughs> yes, and I put some setting powder underneath my eye just to set my concealer but it's all this and um i am absolutely loving this serum this will be most definitely like uh my go-to for the summertime like i can't wait to be in the streets all summer long yes if you guys feel me if you want to be in the streets all summer long comment down below <laughs> The concealer is amazing. Now, this concealer is pretty expensive at Walgreens. It was about $13. Drugstore concealer, $13. But you know what? It's really good. So I'm not going to complain. But this was about $14, like $15 at Walmart. So get your drugstore, um, your drugstore makeup from Walmart if you can to save a couple dollars. But it was it was a pleasant experience um wearing l'oreal if you like this content please like it and subscribe i will love you forever until next time bye